the card monkey, a mod very similar to the boomer monkey, giving us a total of 15 new upgrades. How far can I go with each path and as a 555? Let's find out. Welcome back everyone. At a card monkey, adds a new custom tower theme around playing cards. Look at him. And he also has a whole paragon. God king of spades i did not know this so we could try this out royal flush ace of spades twist of fate so we'll just test out each one see how far they can go yeah let's do it let's have some fun i mean we could do cubism i want to see him next to a boomerang monkey actually whoa why does he look like that so that's how it rose it let's see this guy Okay, so it just throws it straight. Okay, but why does it actually look like that? Why is the model so weird? Okay, so this is a paragon. It looks different. It looks somewhat normal. It says tier five. It doesn't look the best. Second pass, all right. Last path, I think it's just, just how it renders and stuff. Uh, this is a mod from two years ago, I think. Two years plus. Whatever. If it looks bad, it looks bad for right now. Tier five does not look terrible. Three of a kind, four of a kind. So more just damage wise, this is probably pierce. I know this is good against ceramic and fortified ones. Okay, this one is more speed wise and stuff i would say so let's place him down right here man he looks beautiful exactly like the model i guess we could just start the round i don't know what i want to do i think i might do top path first then i could do second then i could do third and then paragon i think that's good for the video and i do have a mod that can change around so we don't have to wait all that way let's draw the down I, I guess we could place him like right here or something place down his little action figure right next to him so we got some a lot of money so most likely first off we're probably like a five Two zero. We don't really need camel balloons. That can help with Geraldo. Wild card can attack all types of balloons. So I'm guessing that's left protection, most likely. I wish this guy did not look like this, but this is, I think, update like 41.3, something like that. So this guy's not even supposed to look like this. Do pair. Bam. I do really want to see God King of Spades. That would be sick. I didn't even know they had a paragon until I just started recording. So Reva kind of powering up even more. I mean, he does rip through balloons. Look at that. Let's do cut the deck. Cards have increased pierce. We could start some banana farms too. I don't know. Let me get wild card first. So now he can shoot all kind of balloons. I mean, at this point, four of a kind. Why not? Boom. Okay. Um, he is having a lot of trouble. Can we add a stone on him? We could. I say we do that. I think it's like more pierce or something like that. I don't know. But let's see if we can actually start banana farms. All right. Straight flush. We got a two or four now. So he looks the exact same. Why is he so bad? I mean, he can pop lead ones at least. That's good. Now, can he take down a Moab on round 40? I would say no. I really don't think he's going to be able to take it down. No way. All right. Round 40 as a 4-2-0. And okay, he actually destroys it though. That's actually really good. Only the bottom path, if we do like a 5-2-0, it shoots faster and he has camera protection. So I think having wild cards hitting every type of balloon is a lot better. Yeah, he has a lot of trouble with camo ones. His pierce sucks. We just have a Gary's fire on him right now. That should help. I mean, good thing is Royal Flush is very cheap. It only has 17k on easy. Let's do that. Bam. Now he looks insane. All right, so he's able to pretty much pop ceramic ones. Let's see a BFB at a 520. Only camo potion. One rip, two rips. Okay, he actually takes it out really well. Oh my gosh. That's just a tier 5 too. That's insane. I don't know how far it can go alone though. Let's see these ceramic ones. Bam, completely pops it. So it's just very high damage, pretty high pierce. But let's see how far you can actually go. Just alone, a 520. Okay, he already failed. So round 64, 520. We can get rid of him. Let's see if a 502 does any better. So let's see if that does any better. He throws it a lot faster, but he can't hit every single balloon type. So maybe a little better. I think he should be able to. Okay. A 502 actually makes it farther. Oh, I think he might actually fail here. All right. So he makes it one round farther. Well, that was the first tier. Oh, you know what this looks like? Yeah, look at that. They look exactly the same as a Bloon Master Alchemist. Let's check out the middle path. We got cut the deck, increase pierce. It's all the balloon types, of course. Ace Wild, Ceramic for five ones. Rose, a super ace card. Ooh, that looks like Moab Eliminator. An Ace of Spades. Uh, let's do a... We could a 250. Let's just max it at this point right now. Ace of Spades. Bam. He looks like um I think it's Glaive Lord. Yeah, it's definitely Glaive Lord. So his model's Glaive Lord. He does have a lot of problems with ceramic ones. Actually, no. Let's see this Moab though. Oh, he's gonna let some pass. Oh, he does have an ability. I mean he tears up BFBs, honestly. I want to see this ability though. Alright, let's use it right now. I guess that was that. Oh, he doesn't have camber protection if we do this one route. Yeah, so he just cleans up ceramic ones completely. Right, let's see the ability. Bam. 
Oh, it goes all the way across. Okay, without a doubt, this guy is gonna make it at you really far. So I do wonder how far an Ace of Spades can go. I don't know how much damage he actually does to Moab class ones. It's probably high. This tower is actually really cool. Okay, I like this. I like this a lot. It is definitely really high damage though. Like just one shots all these ceramic ones. All right, one more round until round 80. Let's see it. Let's see a nice zoom. MG. I'm not gonna use the ability. How many shots? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There's quite a bit. I mean, he still destroys it though. Oh, do you think this guy can beat a bad though? That would be crazy. I mean, DDTs maybe. Okay, let's just change around to round 90. Let's see it. DDTs. Oh okay i see you now what is it round 97 oh it's gonna send them all at once oh no that's reinforced the omgs let's see if we can actually take it out yeah this guy's nuts though Wait, imagine if you could throw it even faster all right this is like a really strong round let's use the ability round 98 and this is just by himself too okay maybe ability right here i maybe just throw down can i sell a genie i want to complete this round and i want to see a zomg oh boy and reinforce ones use the ability okay he cannot exactly take it out mm, that's good to know let's try a was that zero five two Oh, the bad. I mean, I guess we could try out the bad. Why not? Now, he's probably not going to do the same amount of damage, though. So that's going to be a little annoying. But, all right, can you... Oh, he got one rip. This is ability. He didn't really do anything, honestly. Two rips, I think. Can he take out a bad, actually? I mean, he's actually really close. Oh, he almost popped it. Yeah, he almost popped that bad. I'm just going to set it to around, what, 99 i don't think he had the actual camo i mean the ability completely pops it so he could definitely do that but not round 100 for sure no way if we do redoing potions everything is that you gonna pop it oh my gosh that's insane and another one bam so he almost does it he almost does it well let's try a 052 so as a 052 he's gonna shoot faster he doesn't need camera protection let's see round 100 yeah this guy's definitely a lot weaker his damage look at that it goes by 50 every single shot he does yeah what well, if we see this guy right here let's see it it goes up by like 200 or something 150 each time every single shot is three times as more than the other one okay so that was for the ace of spades he could pretty much make it to round i think 99 and he fails okay 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 but we do have another path the bottom path the twist of fate Air protection attack faster attacks even faster with bigger range Twist of fate cards can explode stun balloons and make balloons give extra money Ooh, this is the most expensive path he looks like yeah 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 yeah. moab press or moab diamond no moab press yeah look at that they look exactly alike pretty much that's actually sick though i say we do a i don't know zero two five let's see it i mean he shoots really fast oh oh my gosh look at his damage that is very very weak so maybe just do round 40 for him oh maybe i should not have a bad do round 40 let's see against him against one moab again this is 42,000. so that's a lot all right a moab let's see bam, 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 bam. his damage is really slow though yeah i mean this is he can hit all types of cards so he can't stun balloons what if we send like rounds i think 61 it is yeah so definitely a 025 he's gonna struggle a lot i want to see how far a 025 can go and i'm gonna set the round to one and see what exactly round he fails on okay so i'm round six 62 he fails on now that was with second path it's a cross path so just damage in person whatever let's see increased damage though so as a 205 let's see it oh he is gonna need an mib for sure set it to round one and see how far he can go okay so he just throws three of them at once and it just explodes and stuns two zomgs round 85 no problem Oh, never mind. That was a problem. So he feels at round 84. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. So out of all three of these guys, this guy made it the furthest. He did pop, I think, round 95, something like that, as a, I think, a 250. But we could see a nice guy to King of Spades. That would be really cool. So we could just test out Paragon. Just, I think level one is going to be. Yeah, level one. Paragon one. Now, exactly what does it do? So he stuns it completely. He shoots extremely fast. Let's bump it up to round 140. Or round 40, actually. All right, let's see. Round 40. This is super slow. Bam. One shots it. Round 60. A BFB. I mean, he just absolutely obliterated that one too. Oh my gosh. ZOMG. 
Let's step it up already. Oh my gosh. Okay. I think I need to play that again. His radius is actually pretty big. Okay. So it takes maybe like 10 cards. It actually destroys it. Sometimes the hand of fate must be forced. All right. Let's see DDTs. Um, it should send three. And he just one shots them. Okay. I'll put it up to round 99. Reinforce ones. Two shots them. I think he actually one shots if he makes contact with them. I mean, at that point, let's see round 100. Oh, we already have round 100 right here. I think he's going to one shot it. One. Uh, okay. That takes a long time though. But at degree one, he destroys it. Oh my gosh. I mean, might as well just start placing Paragon totems. I want to see a degree 100. All right. Round 119. This is, I believe, three bads. And he actually just rips them all apart. Oh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, okay. I would say that this Paragon is kind of busted. Just a little bit though. Just, just a little bit. Screw it. Let's bump it up to 140. Let's see. One Rainforce bad. This is actually being nuts though. Look at this. Brrr. Not even a rip though. Oh my gosh. Okay, never mind. Two rips already. He's actually tearing it apart. Holy. And... He actually destroys a round 140 reinforced BAD. The amount of pops he's getting. That's insane. Oh, reinforced DDTs. Okay, so he does fail on round 141 as a Paragon for degree one. All right, I think I'm going to try to get degree 100 and we can see how that goes. All right, so I think I have enough. I got a couple Paragon totems, you know, 57. Got a couple sacrifices. So let's see what he is. Max Paragon. And it's... You're joking, right? All right, now let's try this again. Max Paragon. Paragon. Please tell me. Please tell me it's 100. I'm, I'm going to be so mad if it's not. And you're joking, right? 98. I think I just need a couple more Paragons. All right, there should be it. And oh my gosh, you're joking, right? 99. All right, this better be it. No way it's not. Please, 100, 100, 100. That's all I'm asking. There we go. Here we go, 100. Oh, thank gosh. All right, let's turn it to round 100. We got to see against a bad. How many shots does it take for it to kill a bad? About to be in range right about now. Oh my gosh. That was so quick. All that time for a round just for degree 100. Bump it up to 140. Edgy tears it apart. Look at the damage is just flowing through. No way. Round 160 maybe oh a couple bads all right now it's having some trouble i mean it's tearing it apart a hey, round 170 maybe oh just a bunch of zmgs 180 all right we can do let's see 200 round 200 it is a reinforced bad it, it's actually this is only three times speed let's do normal that you shooting really fast it can it take down just one even one possibly please tell me all this work did not go to waste and it fails to ddts okay well, no way did all that work just for it to fail to round 200. The Paragon is sick though. Like, look at that. Just actually mauls through everything. But there's one thing else. A 555 card monkey. All right, I'll be back with you guys when I have it. All right, here it is. A 555 card monkey. Look at that range. Practically global range. Let's just start with, you know, round 40. Let's see how that does. Again, just one. Moab. Okay. It takes that out pretty well. Let's see one BFB though. It is taking forever. It should attack right about now. It, it like three shots it. All right. That's it. ZOMG. Usually the 555s five, five, five are better than Paragons. Usually. ZOMG actually tears apart. Okay. Let's see round 90 DDTs. Anytime. And one shots on the completely. Round 100. Let's see. A BAD. This guy's going to shred, I bet. No rips yet. Okay. There's one rip. Two rips. Three rips. Four rips. Five. Wow. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Right. 119 possibly i mean it would be three bads and he's actually tearing apart like look at that we have the ability to we can just step it up all the way to round 140 reinforced bad he's actually mauling it apart i already got one rip two rips look at that damage just stacking over and over and over oh my gosh no he's gonna pop it against bads he's not that good but we can try round 200 that's like two or three reinforced BADs. Oh my, not even a rip yet. So it's safe to say that a 555 is weaker than a Paragon. Okay, well, that is all I have for you guys today. You know, we looked at the Royal Flush, the Ace of Spades, and the Twist of Fate, and also the God King of Spades, the Paragon. But that is all I have for you guys today. Enjoy the rest of your days, and I will see you guys later. Peace.